It was a real loud noise. Boom, boom. I know what it was. Residents in this Fort Pierce neighborhood now know that noise was from a drug raid. I can't believe it. I'm totally shocked. I'm totally shocked. I'm totally shocked that that was happening right there. This man admits he thought something wasn't quite right. I had noticed cars cars would pull up and guys would get out of the car, but they wouldn't shut their cars. They'd walk in or either that or the guy would actually come out and meet them at the car. Sheriff Kim Mascara described the home deputies raided Tuesday as a drive through for drug addicts. He says detectives found 600 grams of heroin at the home during that raid, the largest heroin-related bust in the history of the St. Lucie County Sheriff's Office. We see families ruined, we see lives lost, we see communities torn apart, and uh, we want the help uh, for those individuals. However, if you're a dealer, you're in our sights and we're coming for you. WPBF spotted this scene less than 24 hours after the raid, another drug bust, another arrest. Investigators admit arrests like these make a difference. Anytime you can get that stuff off the street, more power to them, you know, I mean, more power to the cops. Investigators tell me they are now bringing detectives with them to these overdose scenes. They say the goal is to try and get information about the person who's responsible for these illegal drugs and arrest them. In Fort Pierce, Angela Rosier, WPBF 25 News. This is your brain. This is drugs. This is your brain on drugs. Any questions? Um, yeah, I have questions. Prescription drugs aren't as bad as street drugs, right? Weed's legal, isn't it? Drinking is worse than smoking weed. Isn't it? Why it is heroin, heroin so, so addictive? Molly just makes you feel happy. I have questions. Mom? Dad, did you ever try drugs? They're going to ask. Be ready. Go to drugfree.org. A message from Partnership for Drug-Free Kids.